Every country in the world has its differences, beliefs, culture, and tradition. But there is one thing that connects the world. These are the patterns and rhythms that we do not usually notice when we are doing our everyday activity. And these are all part of one thing, mathematics. These characteristics are applied in art and culture. This can be witnessed through paintings and can be heard through music. The Philippines have a different approach in terms of art, as it can be seen through its culture such as festival, showing different patterns, counting their steps in their choreography, and showing rhythm in their dances. Mathematics may greatly help the Filipinos to dig deeper into exploring the art and culture of the Philippines. The Philippines has become one of the popular destinations for tourists because of its beautiful tourist spots. Like for example, rivers, different islands, and volcanoes, and etc. But aside from its tourist spots, Philippines was also known from its culture and arts. We all know it has always been a challenge to make an abstract mathematical concept meaningful and realistic for learners of mathematics. This is undoubtedly the situation for indigenous students as well. Ethnomathematics, the study of interaction of mathematics and culture that is now making its way into the Indigenous People's Education or IPED curriculum of the government of the Philippines, is one potential response. In ways that go beyond simply passing math class, ethnomathematics can help. This opens up doors by encouraging them to see, appreciate, and feel the connection between mathematics and their lives as IPs. At least this is what is being sought to do by ethnomathematics. Since math is not independent of society, culture is math. The Philippines was also known for its arts like making bags, mats, weaving, and cultural clothing. It showcases different patterns, shapes, colors, and lines which can be associated with mathematics. Dr. De Las Peñas notes that even without formal mathematical experience, using a mixture of weaving and counting methods, weavers are able to construct intricate geometric patterns representing advanced levels of geometry and algebra. These are only few examples of how we associate mathematics with the history and arts of the Philippines. Studying this will provide a deeper basis and concept of how complex the Philippines culture and art are. It must be true that math is everywhere. Our chosen topic allows us to explore how mathematics flourished and influenced humanity, not only in the Western world, but also to other civilizations. In our history classes, the Greeks have always been a standard when it comes to this discipline. Science and mathematics are just two of their contributions in the Western culture, which placed them into glory and brought knowledge that is exemplary among others. But for the other parts of the world like the Philippines, for example, how does mathematics connect to the community, to the culture, how did it make the life of our ancestors change and progress? Some of us are not that much aware, but mathematics nourishes Filipino culture through observing the different types of our ethnic musical instruments. The designs, sizes, weights, various pitches and tones being produced make listeners feel a distinct vibe. These are also used depending on occasions. Since our ancestors were animists, there are also instruments being played to sound as if they're one with nature. It is also their way to please and give thanks to nature's spirits. It is the beauty of mathematical notes that causes harmony to become a music. A music that will release colorful and unique culture among Filipino ethnic groups. Music is art as it serves as an ingredient to a culture. A country that treasures culture progresses. Patterns can be seen all around us. You can see it in traditional clothes, 
weaving mats, and even today, you can still see patterns in wallets, shirts, etc. And behind these beautiful patterns, as a form of art in Philippine culture, mathematics can be seen. Significantly, the impact of mathematics in the Philippine culture and arts are seen in these patterns. It can be seen in weaving traditional mats. Traditional mats have symmetries and repeated sequences that both arts and mathematics show. Mathematics plays a vital role in the Philippine arts and culture where mathematics or mathematical symmetry is used to analyze or to improve the understanding of the culture from the artifacts just by looking at the patterns from the fabric. Not only that, but the use of the method of ethnomathematics or the techniques or art of explaining, knowing, and understanding the diverse cultural context has been the answer for the study of the intersection of mathematics and culture for indigenous Tapaaral ang mangyan na angkop sa kulturang aalagaan o pamanaka, an indigenous school built in 1999 for the Mangyan community in Occidental Mindoro has been utilizing the realities in Mangyan life to teach mathematical concepts. Example is relating algebraic expression where counting the number of cracks on the ground is known as values, while numbers of tubers under each crack is the unknown variable. Pattern and sequences were also related into the ritual performances. In short, mathematics is not just about abstract equations, but a real part of the Bangyan's daily lives. And since every lesson begins and ends with a reiteration of their values, their understanding of their own culture is not only respected but enhanced as well. As the mathematics has taught them to see what math means to their lives, at least this is what as the mathematics trying to do because math cannot be separated from culture and math is culture. <laughs> Mansani